Hey everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you how to read that wonderful git diff output. We'll use my GitHub repo as an example. And git show will tell us the most recent patches committed. Now if we scroll to this line, we have quite a bit of information. The main area of focus is this. This header is also known as a diff hunk. You heard that right, a diff hunk. These also show up when you do a git diff and many other git commands. If you were to take two files, the original file, file A, and lined it up next to the new file, file B, a diff hunk would be the blocks of lines that are different. These diff hunks are essentially the patches you've committed. The left part of this header is the original file for file A, and it reads, starting at line one and for 12 lines, the original file includes the lines with the dashes or minuses. The right part of this header is the new file or file B, and it reads, starting at line one, and for 16 lines, the new file includes the lines with pluses. We can recreate these patches manually from this information. We'll copy everything until the prompt because even new lines are included in the line count number. And just by pure chance, this patch only takes up one page. We'll open two notepad instances and paste the same diff hung into both. Now we will act as if file A is on the left and file B is on the right. We'll delete the pluses from the left copy and the minuses on the right because the minus signals file A and the plus signals file B. And now we know what the previous block of code looked like on the left and the most recent one on the right. We can also delete the minus and plus signs as they are not in the original source code. Here's how to view this diff hunk from two other perspectives. One way is with Git itself and by adding the word diff option. This will now show the difference at the word level instead of at the line level. The red or dashed words are from file A and the green or plus words are in file B. And a third, more advanced way is to use a combination of vim diff, git show, and process substitution. File A as the left argument, and file B as the right argument. And this should match our notepads from earlier. Thank you.